नमस्ते आई एम मंजुला वेलकम टू मंजुला किचन टुडे आई विल बी मेकिंग डेट एंड रीजन चटनी दिस एक्सॉटिक स्वीट एंड सावर चटनी इज माइल्डली स्पाइस्ड मेक्स ए ग्रेट ट्रीट दिस चटनी इज ए ग्रेट कॉम्प्लीमेंट टू एनी मील डेट एंड रीजन चटनी इज क्विक एंड ईजी recipe to make this chutney will serve six for this chutney we need 1 cup pitted dates 1/4 cup of raisins 1/4 cup of brown sugar 2 tablespoon of tamarind pulp 1 teaspoon of roasted cumin seed powder half a teaspoon of salt 1/4 teaspoon of red chili powder One fourth teaspoon of black pepper, salt and pepper. You can adjust to your taste. One fourth inch of ginger, two black cardamom. You can buy this in Indian grocery store, and approximately three fourth cup of water. Let's get started. Soak the raisins at least half an hour before. I have already done this before. As you see, they are double in size, and I have drained the water. Now I am going to cut the dates in about eight pieces. So as you see, they are small pieces. So dates are done, and now I am going to slice the ginger. So first, peel the ginger, and we need to slice them thin. I just cut them in two pieces and then just slice them thin. And so ginger is done, and now I am going to crush the black cardamom. It's easy to crush in the mortar. So just peel off the skin, and as you see, seeds are much larger than the green cardamoms. So now I'm going to just crush them. The cardamoms are crushed, and while you are crushing them, you can smell this very sweet aroma. I am ready to make the date and raisin chutney. In a saucepan, first I will add water, sugar, tamarind paste. pepper black pepper salt roasted cumin powder and black cardamom bring it to boil on medium high after it boils then we will lower the heat and let it simmer for 1 to 2 minutes mix the spices to make sure sugar is dissolved mixture of spices are boiling in water i am going to reduce the heat to low and let it simmer for a minute before we add the dates and raisins it has been boiling for a minute so i am going to add the dates raisins and ginger mix it and bring it to boil as soon as it starts boiling we will turn off the heat and let it sit for about an hour before you will serve this okay chutney has start boiling so i am going to turn off the heat and let it sit uh, like i said for an hour so everything is marinated really good and the uh, gravy as you see right now is thin it will get thick uh, i can already smell the uh, ginger cardamom and the cumin seed powder chutney has been sitting for an hour as you see gravy has thickened it looks really nice uh, chutney is ready to be served and it's always served at room temperature 
date and raisin chutney is looking delicious and has a nice aroma of roasted cumin seed and cardamom powder. My mother used to make often this chutney for family get together. I could notice the chutney will disappear in no time. It was so hard to resist. Date and raisin chutney can be refrigerated for a month. Enjoy it. Thank you. Till we meet again, check out more recipes on manjulaskitchen.com.